today's result day and if you want to learn saving investing and trading lessons from the life of dr jose rizal check this video out Number one on savings. In the 1913 book, Lineage, Life, and Lessons, ay mali. Lineage, Life, and Labors of, of Jose Rizal, ang sabi nun, he was able to save more than 5,000 pesos in 7 months. Guys, nung panahon niya, malaki na yun. If you can remember from our history classes, it was said na he was also fond of lottery. Pero let's let's some of some of na napanalunan niya part of that savings pero um what i want to point out is that regardless of of kahit fond of gambling and lottery siya he was able to um save he was studying in europe um sobra din siyang nagtipid para makapag-save nag nag nagtipid siya sa pagkain sa clothes and even naglalakad siya as as means of transportation kasi yung, yung may goal siya eh, uh, dun sa pinagsisiva niya he studies and for printing of his books so kung ikaw nanonood ngayon and wala ka pa ring savings and that's a fresh start para makapag-save ka Number two lesson is on investing. Rizal bought a property near Dapitan where he was exiled. Um, bumili siya ng lupa. Nag-invest siya, nag siya ng property doon and pinatayuan niya ng school and ng hospital. The Philippine Stock Exchange has not been established during their time yet. But may mindset na siya na mag i siya. Although hindi lang sa stocks, hindi lang sa companies, pero nag-invest siya into property. So he has a mind of, um, we can learn from him yung mindset na investing. So kung ikaw nanunood ka ngayon and wala ka pa investment and you have been or you may have been watching my videos or downloaded some of my um, e-books about stock, uh, Philippine stock market investing and trading and how you can start. It's a fresh start para mag-aral and mag-start ng mag-invest. Okay, number three, trading. Kasi tinayo niyang hospital and school, nagturo siya doon ng libre sa mga bata and gumamot ng mga mahihirap na tao for free. Yung income niya came from his parents na nag-filter out ng mga patients from different points of the country na more than willing to pay him for his services. Yung pera na kinita niya doon is yung ginamit niya sa trading. So, ano tinitrade niya? niya? So, apart from the hospital and the school, meron din siyang abaka business and store na yun yung itinitrade. Kasi diba nung panahon nila ganun? Tawag dun? Barter! <laughs> sobra, sobra hindi nakikinig ng history kasi. Barter, ayan, exchange of goods and services. Tapos hindi lang yun, Rizal also bought diamonds as a secure way of carrying his funds. And what can we learn from this? Sa panahon natin ngayon, on how we trade in the Philippine stock market, we buy stocks, um, and then we sell them, and then we buy other stocks. So we trade, we trade within the market. You would also learn from dun sa mga ibang books niya, like Pali Matangare, El Filibusterismo, and dun sa piece niya na Hymns of Labor, sabi dun, go to the field to till the land, for the labors of man sustains the family home and the motherland. So I hope this video inspires you to save, invest, and trade. Next year, ayan, start <laughs> next year, kung hindi ka pa nakakapag-start, mag-save, mag-save ka na, kung may savings ka na, start to invest, and if you're already investing and you wanna try trading, then go ahead and do so. For for Dr. Jose Rizal, money symbolizes hard work and should be used to do productive things. So, be productive, start saving, start investing, start trading, stop watching this video. Joke lang. If it's your first time watching this video, my name is Chris and I started this YouTube channel so that I can help Filipinos save, invest, and trade in the Philippine stock market. Because I believe that we live in one of the greatest times where internet is just accessible and we can save and invest in the stock, save, invest, and trade in the stock market all online without the hassle. So there's just so much opportunity in the stock market. And I believe that every Filipino deserves an equal opportunity to learn and invest, to learn how to invest in the stock market. And if you want to follow me, we have a private Facebook group. And if you have no idea talaga kung ano yung stock market, you can download this book 
And after reading this 32-page ebook, you will now be ready to um, start investing in the Philippine stock market. So I hope this video helps you to become a beginner to a winner. See you on the next video.